So now you would think that means he's more shopworn than Juan Manuel. Goal for the feature bout of the evening. He weighed in at 125 and three quarter pounds. 28 wins coming by way of knockout. This could be a special one, folks. Round number one. Overhand right of Orlando Salido is more take his time and use his skills. Salido, regardless of what Lopez is, always has in every single fight. And first round scheduled for 12. In their last fights, Wang has in the purple and silver. I can't believe Salido got up from it. And this first round, very <laughs> relaxed, Ooh. keeping his gut. When the opponent gets close, he stands straight up. It, it makes him accessible to those big right hands. Lopez the Matador. Nice right hook and pivot by. Unload with the right. Instead, he landed a really good left he, hook. He, and hello, hello. Barbara, his ex-wife, showing support. But it's it's good on many levels to see that the family is reconciled. And I know that first round was a fill-out round, but I know she... And now, Salido trying to jump on Lopez. Oh, oh, oh. Right hand. Lopez is trying to do something very difficult tonight. Change his... The feeling that he will resort back to his boxing identity. A left... Salido closing in. Now, Lopez. With a nice little left uppercut by Salido. It hasn't been a frenetic pace, but it's been a lot. But again, he stands straight oh, up. Oh, a nice left. Lopez will have to come out of his shell, and maybe that was it. Salido offense. He's working the body, and there's the clubbing right hand that we saw so The third round in Puerto Rico, the former champion. And in the first two rounds. And let's take a look at the... He really landed that big knockout punch. It's these punches that are getting through. And it's... Lopez, we're accustomed to seeing. The one that... He's trying to do what he's supposed to do, but he's just not that man. He hit by these big shots. He might have a chance to win this fight, but he's not... Fighting very intelligently now. He's not... Now he's not as wild as he was. I may be hurt. Wanma not answering back. I took the championship from you here. And well, Lopez, this isn't the man we're accustomed to see. Uh, but he's going to fight because he's a champion that he is. He's going to fight. Well, blows, but here is a punch that we're not accustomed to seeing. A left up. We begin the fourth round schedule for Lopez. Orlando Salido, the champion, in silver and blue, Juan Manuel Lopez to engage. A hand much more than he did in the first fight, and honestly, has actually... Round Salido, 29 of 63, 46%. Hungry. He lost his title before in his first defense, and he know what... It we have to remind you that one right hook from... Where is Juan Mas? We're waiting to see Manuel Lopez. And that's Followed by about a bounce in his step now here in the fourth. It's been his best round. He's got the crowd oh. behind him. Lopez in this round, but he has come back and made a round of it. There. Getting him here with an elbow. Whacked him on the side. He has all his loved ones, his fans here. And uh, he has all the motivation. Last round, he landed his most significant punches, and I thought there was some... And he took the title from in purple. 12 rounds for the WBO Featherweight Championship. You can say for Lopez, he landed only 19% of his punches. He throw these overhand, looping overhand shots that you don't see, and you run... Lopez, not using any angles, can find himself in this fight. Nice loop, Salido, bending over of a boxer puncher and he's having some success at right into it so he yep. can land those leverage Le have leverage on it and you know i think i don't think he's tricking he's no. not he's not showing any oh he barely missed it. oh there it is a left hook by salito moving in for the kill 18 seconds oh. to go and he slips that was is salito hurt 
And that's the end of the round. Round dramatically. Walked into a perfect right hook. Felix Trinidad likes it, that's for sure. And it shows you the toughness of simple. Orlando Salido, the champion, knocked down at the end round. Now the judges may not. Well, no, you know what? That's always been one of his best punches, that little sneaky right hook. And you know, Lopez took that right hand better that time than he had. This is turning into some fight, gentlemen. <laughs> that might have been the worst. First round, Salido was winning the round. We have Salido winning 9 to 46. Rico, Orlando Salido, the champion in silver and blue. Salido going down at the end of the fifth. In this round. Salido jumping on him, straight right. And that's the end of the sixth. There's the hook again from Salido. It's not his signature punch. And then mixing up the hooks and the right hands more so. Going under the left eye of Orlando Salido as we head into the seventh round. Fifth round by the challenger and former champion. Well, he cannot continue to stand. Score the big knockdown at the end of the fifth. Salido, though, it seemed like it's so much unnecessary punishment. Left hook by his gone 12. He finished out on his feet practically. It's Rogers Matagua. He continues to tough Mexican fighter. Great head movement. Of Juan Manuel Lopez, or Salido for that matter. But man, is he taking a lot of punishment. Well said, Antonio. That right hand mob fighting for his life right. Lando Salido. He from the Great action here, folks, at the end of the seventh. That left hook, well, there's a right actually to the head. And then here comes the body punch. And though Salido is doing, really, and there again, the looping. Salido is 31, has been fighting since he was fifth featherweight championship of the world. Hey, hey, Orlando, 31, I feel like this is the beginning of something big for me. Nothing. At the end of the fifth round, Lopez, with a sneak 164 of 391, 42%. The same amount of punches, about 20 more for Salido, but he is landing at a better rate. So, and Salido says, This is more than Lopez we're accustomed to see. It is probably winning most of the rounds, we think. Oh, here again, Lopez is standing straight up, and he's susceptible for those big overhand four punch combination. This is, this, Lopez is acquitting himself. Juan Ma. Moving forward oh. by Salido. So losing the round, he's still been the aggressor. Well, the 31 years wow. of age. Lopez, perhaps guilty of combination punching, getting through the guard for the most part of Lopez. Sure. That punch can be a surprise punch in this fight. And that Ando Salido, the Mexican champion. Ninth round, scheduled for 12 for the W. He has won three and... 1-1, lost decision. Lopez has been 12 rounds once, but against Matago. Now Lopez going to the body. Lopez. Oh, oh. It came down to it. He'll find Lopez in the center of the ring, going toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Right hook. Uh, both eyes of Orlando Salido. Oh. Listen to this crowd. Uppercut, a left hand this time. 40. Wow. Incredible. Talking about landing all out. Woo. Lopez 37 to 22, but it felt closer than that, didn't it? Added over the whole three round period. And the lead right hand by Cito's eyes. Yeah. Swelling under both. He's blinking. Then Lopez. Oh, oh my! Lopez he's hurt. He's out. Oh, and he goes down. So. Got Lopez in big trouble. Knocked him down. The knockdown.
there would be a huge right hand. That's uppercut. Those were tremendous punches and followed by left. Now, it's important to nubbing, and he looks at him and says, no, I've got to stop this fight. That's a great stop. Yes, the contest, the winner by way of technical knockout, Isali.